Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can create and edit events in Calendar on the iPhone 14 series. First, let's go back to the home screen by swiping up at the bottom of the screen. Now on the home screen or in the app library, open up the Calendar app. Next in the calendar, I'm going to go back to my monthly view. So you can tap on the back here to go back to your calendar. This is showing you the whole year. I can tap on the month to view the monthly view. I can go up or down to go to the previous month or the next month. So I'm going to tap on today. And so I want to, if you want to create events for today, you can tap on the add button. Or if you want to select a different day, you can swipe across here and select a different day. You can also go back in here and select a day uh, while you are in this monthly view. So say uh, on the 14th of February, um, you can go down and tap on the add button to create a new event. And then uh, in the title, you can put in dinner at 7 p.m. So there are some suggestions here. Uh, dinner at 7 to 8 p.m. You can use the suggestions or you can just create your own uh, ta event title. So I'm going to use the suggestions here. So I tap on that dinner at 7 p.m. So it will automatically set in the date and the time. You can choose if it's an all day event or simply just a specific start and end time. Next, you can also choose a travel time. So you can choose five minutes travel to get to where you want to go. Or you can just leave it blank. Um, if it's not a repeating event, you can choose whether this is going to be a repeating event or not. So it can be repeating every day, every week, every two weeks, every month, every year. Or you can tap on custom and choose the frequency uh, for that particular event. Next, you can choose where this event will be saved to, which calendar. In here, I have a few um, calendar uh, connected to the, the, the calendar app. So in here, we can choose... Uh, family, uh, the email account from Gmail calendar or Outlook calendar. I've got Yahoo calendar or the iCloud calendar. So I'm going to select the default calendar from iCloud calendar. And you can also um, select invitees. You can, you can also invite other people to your calendar. You can also set alert as well. So here it is by default it is set to one hour uh, bef before travel time alert. Uh, you can also set a second alert. And then while you are during the calendar meeting or the event, during the event, you can set your calendar to show as busy or free. Finally, you can add attachment to your event and you can also write notes in here. For example, bring drinks and then tap on add. All right, so here we have successfully created an event in the calendar. If you need to go back and edit a, an event, so you can tap on that and then tap on edit at the top. And in here, you can then change your, you can make the changes. So say you want to change your dinner time back to 6 p.m. instead. So we can choose dinner at 6 p.m. And you can change that to 6 p.m. and finish at 7 p.m. And that's it. And if you don't need to change anything else, you can tap on the done button and then tap on save for this event only or save for future events. So we're going to choose save for this event only and then tap on the back key. And also you can see here, I have accidentally uh, set a repeat for this event. So I'm going to go in and remove the repeat. So in here, I'm going to remove the repeat so just gonna see where is the repeat in here. I just um, saw it. So we go back in here, tap on edit, and then tap on delete. So I'm gonna tap on delete, and then so that um, repeating event could be for something else. So let me just go back and check. So here is another one. So I'm going to tap on that one, delete event, and now I'm going to choose delete all for future events. And that's it. So now we have set an event. So there's no more repeating event, as you can see. And that is how you can create an event and how you can edit an event in calendar on the iPhone 14 series. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe.
to my channel for more videos.